Hello everybody and welcome Hi. back to our channel. We have another snack crate to unbox um, and taste test today. Yeah, it's having pulls on there. <laughs> All right, so let's get started. If you don't know, Snack Crate is a monthly subscription box. They will send you a box of snacks from a different country each month. Um, they have anything from candy to chips, crackers, all different kinds of goodies to try. I want chocolate this time. You want chocolate? All right, so this month it's from Morocco. Where's that? It's uh, kind of over by Egypt, I think, like over in that. I like area. Egypt. I might be totally wrong. Okay, well, I see a potato with a smile and wacky <laughs> eyes. Okay. So inside it always comes with a fact sheet about the country I'm not and then this. it also has the menu card where it talks about the different snacks that are in your box and gives you a description which can be helpful because a lot of times the I know packaging the, I know is the in a different language. Smiling. It's in a different language so you can't always understand it. Yeah, the potato with a smiley face and leader chips. I want to try them first. Yeah. Alright, so <laughs> leader chips. Leader chips. They look like just regular potato chips. And it says kebab though. So I wonder if it has a different flavor to it. Ooh, it smells good. Yeah, it smells pretty good. I'll take them. Okay. I don't like it. It smells weird, actually. It doesn't taste good. Like, it's not bad. But yeah, it doesn't taste bad, but I, I I wouldn't I would not eat this like regularly. If I if I could choose to, I wouldn't eat this. I'd rather eat like ruffles. But if you get, if you only thing I could eat, I don't mind. So it's kebab flavor, which on the kebab it looks like it has um, tomatoes, bell pepper, mushrooms. Um, the flavor is different, but it, it doesn't taste gross. It's just different. Yeah. Okay, so next Who's thing. Who's going to choose next? What's the, what's the order going to be? Because I already know what I I'm going to choose gonna next. I'm going to grab randomly. So next That's is... what I wanted to do next. It looks like ice cream cones. Konikos. They look kind of like American bugles. These crunchy cone shaped corn snacks are coated with delicious... I think it's right there. With a delicious... Savory dusting of cheesy goodness. Oh, they're like like the 3D Doritos or like bugles. To me, they look like bugles. They look like those wish Those are so good. It might just be because I love cheese, but they're very cheesy. I'm gonna snack on They are good until we get the next thing out. They have a good crunch to them. Tavin, I don't think we put these in a salad because they don't have much taste. They'd be a little crunchy thing in salad. What? Oh, I want that chocolate bar. <laughs> yeah, that's what I was about to say. You're lucky there's chocolate. I think there's also gum. Okay. Next we have Genova Double Cream Intenso. Looks like that. Looks like kind of like a chocolate cake with some mm -hmm. filling, maybe. It I mean, says... if you turn it this way, this looks like a frown. But if you turn it this way, he's smiling. So I think it's going to taste good. A chocoholic's dream come true, rich spongy layers of chocolate cake with an ooey gooey filling of smooth chocolate ganache. This sounds like something um, that I just, will love. Well, that's it's, a wrapper. It smells like what are those things? It got kind of smashed. <laughs> okay. you gotta smell that's it. what it looks like. Can I smell it again? It smells like mm. familiar. It smells like, like a brownie. Is it, yeah, it smells like a brownie and it looks like one too. That's what Can I was get your say. piece? Oh, it's so squishy and soft. It's like squishy like slime, but... It reminds me of kind of like a Swiss roll. It feels like hair. <laughs> it honestly tastes really good. That I do love chocolate. Good. But... So all chocolate's good, but... It's a little melty. But that's very, very good. It's kind of rich. Um, I could eat that whole thing. That's amazing. I could eat five of them. <laughs> All right, one next scene. we have sandwichy chalk. It looks like a long cookie, maybe. Can I look at this? And it says 
Oh. The perfect on-the-go snack. This delicious treat features two sponge cakes sandwiched together I mean, by a this layer looks of like rich a smile chocolate. Like this, it's, it's like a little smile. Mm-hmm. All right. <clears throat> Whoa. Oh my gosh, it's, it's not it kind of melted and it, got it literally into, looks like yeah. a, a big giant thing of bread. But covered in chocolate. I bet it's gonna taste like that. Yeah. It looks like a little donut. And it tastes like something I've had before. It looks good. It does taste familiar. There's a little bread. Mm-hmm. But it's still really good. A lot of sponge cake. The mm-hmm. chocolate tastes like chocolate ice cream, just not cold. This mm-hmm. is what the chocolate is like, and then it's just like on really squishy bread. This is really good. good. It's less melty than the other one, which is good. Mm hmm. I like that. Mm-hmm. That's really good. It doesn't even melt in your mouth. Okay, next. Oh, yeah, those look like Oreos. Vanilla Oreos. Dwist. Uh, vanilla. They look like vanilla sandwich cookies. Okay. It looks... I don't know what that's... But it says vanilla, so mm-hmm. it's definitely going to be vanilla flavor. It's like something that's... Oh, like they're, kind of, they're kind of big. Yeah, they're like Oreos. I want to try all they, uh, of them. Let's all try at the, at the same time. They almost look like crackers instead of cookie, in a way. It's got mm-hmm. some sandwich filling in there. Mine's like drooping with little filling bits. Okay, you ready? Three, one, two, two. one. Mm. It's, it's like, like a sweet cracker. There's like five cookies. Uh, there's like four cookies in here. I could eat ten packets. Mhm. Um. Delicious vanilla cookies, sandwiching a smooth layer of sweet, sweet cream. What could possibly be better? To me, they taste kind of like vanilla wafers. Mm-hmm. I've never had one. I'm pretty sure I've had one. Those. Yeah, it does taste familiar. These are really good. Like when you swallow it, it has like a taste when you swallow it, kind of like something else I've had. Mm-hmm. I like those a it lot. It is like a little you know, wafer. Mm. Next, we so have nice. Petite Henry's Surfin. It says eight biscuits. It looks like something that you would have with your tea or coffee. Chocolate de eight biscuits. These pleasantly plain biscuits have a delightful crunch and go great with a steamy cup of tea. I don't know what this says, but it might not say anything. Um, Mom, let's save this for last because it's done. Okay. Well, okay. If it's gum, I'm just going to... These remind me of, like, um, the Biscoff cookies that we have. Can you get one? It smells kind of weird. Not as sweet as Biscoff. It honestly kind of just tastes very plain. It has a hint of bread. Mm-hmm. Well, and then just like a crunchy thing. It's really crunchy. These are meant to like dip in coffee or tea, and that's what would give it more flavor. Oh, okay. Mm-hmm. I love tea, so I think it tastes good. Mm-hmm. And you get coffee sometimes. Okay. I drink decaf a lot. Next, Biggie Chalk. Looks like a kind of like a big Kit Kat, maybe. It says double the chocolate, double the fun. This inviting snack. Hello is is what it says right here. Highlights layers of dark chocolate cream between crisp vanilla Mm. flavors. It shows in the inside. It looks amazing. Mm -hmm. (laughs) Oh, it's like a long bar. I could even. I mean, Uh, it kind of melted a little bit. It looks like. One of those, what are they? Kit Kat bars. Mm-hmm. The inside does too. Yeah. Oh, I got a big piece. Um, it's summertime here, so any chocolate that gets shipped to us kind of melts. Yeah. Oh, gosh. Yeah. It tastes like a Kit Kat. It just tastes like a Kit Kat. Maybe mm. it's their Kit Kats. It kind of tastes like coffee. Because I have had coffee flavored. Like, to me, 
just, it just tastes like a Kit Kat to me. To me, it doesn't. The chocolate is very different. It does kind of have a coffee flavor. I think it like, tastes, I don't, yeah, I think it tastes like a, it does have a coffee flavor. The aftertaste is like coffee. Mm-hmm. I'm going to wash this down. The reason I know how. It's good. Yeah. It has a strong taste. You need to wash it down to try something else. Tabago. And it has pictures of what I think is hazelnut. They look like wafer cookies. It's hazelnut. <clears throat> Perfect for a hot day. These crispy vanilla wafer sandwiches mm. are filled with a nutty oh, hazelnut yeah, spread. Yeah, so it has nuts right here. Mm-hmm. I have chocolate on my fingers. Can you get it? Yep, I got it. Oh, there's little pieces. Oh, there's like a, a Kit Kat bar. Here, here, hang on, hang on, hang on. Yeah. It's kind of hard. So, there's quite a few in there. There you go. It's really there a Kit Kat bar, but a hundred times better. The Kit Kat bar, it has a caramel taste. Your caramel taste. It's like caramel and chocolate and the Kit Kat inside, but mixed in like a, like if you, if you had a more sugar mm. to it, it made it 10 times better. So the wafer is really light and airy. Mm. That's really good. I like that a lot. I only have two things left. Next, Tabigo pi- Pyramido. So you, it feels like it's in a pyramid shape. Drawing inspiration from the neighbors to the Far East, these pyramid shaped wafers are packed to the max with rich chocolatey cream. Each bite will send you to a cocoa filled afterlife. So it's a little bit melty too. I don't think it'll actually send us to a cocoa filled afterlife, but it'll uh, taste good. It's kind of in a pyramid shape. Yeah. Kind of hard to tell though because it kind of melted a little bit. Oh. It looks. Oh, yeah. Like Look, the... on the inside, it's really pyramidy. You can see the little stages. Can you get it? Oh, my. No, I can't get it. Oh, oh it has mint in it. I saw the green before it took a bite. It's minty. I don't eat the entire bar. I don't taste mint. Me neither. Um. Mm mm. So it tastes a lot like the other wafer one that we had. Where is it at? I'm gonna eat another one of these. Till b- <laughs> Hang on. So it tastes a lot like this one. The chocolate <laughs> isn't as rich or as dark on mm-hmm. the pyramid one, uh, but they're very, very similar. Um, I think I like the pyramid one more than the other one. The last thing in the box is gum. Flash watermelon, and it has a picture of a clover. So, originating in Casablanca, circa 1959, flash chewing gum has been a staple in Moroccan society ever since. We've provided our favorite fruity, tangy flavor variety. Yeah, it's it's kind of hard. Okay. There you go. Thank you. Let's all there try it at the same time. Um, I find it interesting thing. that it has the clovers. When it's, oh, it's pink. When it's watermelon flavor. It's pink. Let's all try it. It smells time. really, really good. Oh, there's like little um patterns. If you look at the top, there's some patterns. The middle. It looks like um how our Wrigley gum is here. It's the same kind of packaging and three shape. Two. Oh. Oh, it's hard to chew. Mm-hmm. Oh, it's really good. It just has, it's just like a watermelon. Mm-hmm. Mm-hmm. Oh, but it's really hard to chew through. So here we have um, Bubblicious Bubblegum that has watermelon. I almost like just that. accidentally swallowed some, so it's like small. It like shrinks when you chew it enough. Mm-hmm. It's got really good flavor, though. Mm-hmm. That's really, not, really good. Not very much of it. Yeah, I think you would need two sticks, maybe. My favorite was all the chocolate, but everything besides chocolate. 
Out of everything besides chocolate, I'll I try like it. this probably the most. I'll try it. I'll make it or the, the vanilla cookie thing. So I think out of the non candy, this was my favorite. Um, the Conicos. Conicos. The non straight sugar. They look like bugles, American bugles. And then my favorite candy was probably that um chocolate sponge cake that was really really good. i liked all of it I, I just want to eat it all you want to eat it all and the gum was good like i the only thing that we didn't really like was the kebab chips and it's not that they bad. taste bad like, it's they, just it, it was not none of it was bad it's just one thing wasn't good yeah everything else we would buy again I wouldn't buy this again, but uh, yeah, I buy everything for, except for that, but ten of them. It says that it comes in cheese and onion flavor too, so I bet the cheese and onion flavor is probably it probably, probably tastes better. like um. Ruffles. I like I like this little guy though. He goes hello. I just want to eat it all. He goes all the chocolate. Hello. <laughs> all right. Thank you for watching. Bye. Uh, we post videos every month when we get our box. Subscribe to us. Go home now. And we'll see you next time. Bye. I'll turn it off.